Hey Astro Kids and welcome back. And in today's video we'll be talking about Mercury in the 8th house. Let's go ahead and jump right into this. So before we start, just a few quick disclaimers. You first want to understand what sign is Mercury positioned in. Mercury is a very adaptable planet so it will take on the qualities of the sign that it is placed in. You also want to understand are there any planets conjunct with Mercury or aspecting to Mercury as this can impact the functioning of Mercury in your chart as well. It's also important to understand that Mercury's influence will be the strongest during a Mercury Mahadasha. So if you have not seen my video on the Mercury Mahadasha Bukti's, I will leave a link for that above and down below in the description. So what does Mercury represent? Mercury is a planet of knowledge, of intelligence. It represents our rational and reasoning ability, our memory, our dexterity. It is a planet that is all about our skills and our ability to put those skills to use. Mercury is all about adaptability, flexibility. Again, it is a very changeable and adaptable planet, taking on the qualities of anything that is in conjunction or the sign qualities that Mercury is placed in. So Mercury also represents travel and movement. It is a planet of change. Mercury also is representing communication, any kind of language skills, writing ability, anything that is connected to speech and communication can be seen through Mercury. Mercury also represents our inner interactions with our friends, with our siblings can be seen through Mercury. So what does the eighth house represent? The eighth house is a house of sudden ups and downs, of crisis situations, of traumatic situations, but also of sudden gains, of lottery winnings, of anything that is happening suddenly. The eighth house is a great house of transformation. The eighth house also represents longevity. It is all about the quality of life. And the eighth house also is representing any kind of secret mysteries, going deep below the surface, getting into astrology, occult, mysticism, all of this is seen through the 8th house. Along with this, the 8th house is a house of shared resources. Anything dealing with legacies, wills, with joint finances can be seen through the 8th house, along with business partnership situations, and this is a house of stock market. So what happens then when Mercury comes into the 8th house? Well, because the 8th house is a house of sudden crisis and situations, this is a little bit of a challenging position for Mercury. Mercury is a natural benefit coming into this very challenging position. However, the eighth house also is a house of financial dealings and business, as I've mentioned, and Mercury also is a planet that deals with business and finances. So this is an excellent position for business, for self-employment, for entrepreneurship, especially because of the fluctuations of this eighth house. Any kind of financial dealings or business dealings that that involves a lot of change and being able to adapt to those changes can be seen through Mercury in the 8th house. Mercury in 8th house can get you interested in long-term investments, stock market, all of this can be seen through the 8th house as well. So this is a risky position for Mercury. Mercury is not afraid to take risk, is not afraid to make investments here, and so this can be an excellent position if Mercury is in a good position. Mercury here can sometimes also indicate career situations or money-making dealings that are hidden, that are done undercover, below the surface. So also, this is a position where you want to be careful about any kind of underhanded actions. Mercury here, also, you want to be careful about long-term investments because of that changeability of the eighth house. Mercury also is a planet that is about learning, that's about intelligence, and it's going into this secretive house. So this can give you an interest in astrology, in research, in history, in detective work, mysteries. All of this can be seen in this house. This can even make you a writer of mystery novels, of anything in the horror genre. This can definitely make you a great journalist, reporter, anything where you are dealing with hidden or secretive information. Mercury here can definitely make you a great investigator, spy, detective. Anything where you are solving mysteries, solving cases can be seen also with this position. Mercury here definitely makes you very secretive, very much about keeping things close to your vest. So sometimes this is a difficult position for relationships. Depending upon how Mercury is placed here, there can be difficulty with sharing and being open in relationships. If Mercury's placed well, though, then this can create a lot of intimacy and a lot of understanding within your partnerships. Mercury here also is looking for security because Mercury is aspecting directly onto the second house of your wealth and security. So definitely Mercury here is 
looking for security within relationships. And this can be part of the reason why there can be a lot of secrecy and trust issues related to Mercury here in this eighth house. Mercury also makes you very interested in your family and gives you a close connection with your family members. This can get you interested in wanting to know about your ancestry, about your family lineage, wanting to research and dive into this area, sometimes wanting to know about where you have come from, getting into ancestral DNA. All of this can be related to Mercury here in this eighth house. Mercury also can give you a close relationship with food as well because that second house is about what we take into our mouths. So Mercury's aspect onto the second house can also make you interested in healthy eating and diets and all sorts of habits around your eating. But if Mercury is negatively afflicted, then it can also show eating disorders. It can show all sorts of irregularities in your diet. Mercury definitely can increase your health if it is placed positively because again, this eighth house is all about longevity. So this can definitely help with your longevity and health in general, since it is also aspecting onto this second house of your food intake. Sometimes in certain positions, Mercury in the eighth house can also show that your work goes unnoticed. Again, this eighth house is about things that are hidden, that are mysterious. So you can be working behind the scenes or you can find that sometimes if Mercury is badly damaged, that you're not getting a lot of credit for your work. Mercury definitely makes you very intuitive and sensitive when it comes into this eighth house because the eighth house is dealing with all sorts of spiritual and psychic phenomena. Everything that is supernatural can be seen through this eighth house position. So definitely you're in tune with other people's feelings. You have a high degree of sensitivity and intuition in this house. And if Mercury is poorly placed here, then sometimes you can feel overwhelmed by other people's emotions as well. So definitely this is a position where you want to be very careful about who you are surrounding yourself with. Mercury is all about friendship. So pay very close attention to the friends that you surround yourself with. Sometimes because the second house is dealing with food and this is a great position of Mercury for business, this can also indicate anyone who is skilled with cooking, with anything that is related to food in that second house. Mercury here also can give you very powerful communication skills because Mercury's aspecting directly onto the second house of speech. So you can have a very powerful effect when you are speaking to others. But if Mercury is afflicted in this house, then it can also create some harsh speech. So sometimes you want to be careful with this position about how you are speaking and coming across to others. In general, though, Mercury here gives you a huge desire to dive deeper into the mysteries of life. You're seeking deeper meaning, philosophy, deeper understanding with Mercury here in this eighth house. 